This next step, I'm just going to use a craft knife with the blade and I'm going to cut out the exterior line of the fish, as you'll see, and separate it from the background piece of leather. And I'm just going inside the lines that we swivel knife cut earlier and just separating it from the background piece. And I'm just going to go along the exterior line of the project. You want to stop when you get to the fin and then go around the outside edge of the fin you don't want to cut this line or the fish will be missing a fin. And you'll want to remember to have a good cutting surface underneath the leather so it doesn't damage the blade or mar up your work surface. Now I have both of the main pieces cut out. You want to take your craft knife and cut along the center line of the dorsal fin to get them separated. So you should have three pieces. Next thing you're going to do is we're going to come up underneath the gill at about a 45 degree angle and we're going to cut this line all the way around. like so. So we have both of them cut out. And you want to take the last cut we'll do right now is just just a little bit underneath on both sides of the whiskers. So that'll be able to move up a little bit. And then that's all we're going to cut for right now. The next step we're going to do is we're going to skive the leather, which is just a leather craft term for thinning the leather, and we're going to thin the, the back side of the fins here and the tail fin and our dorsal fin. We're going to thin them out. We're going to do it from the back side and just start slow because it's easier to to pull, to skive a little bit of leather off at a time 
than taking too much off. And we're just going to thin it down a little bit to the edges. Up here is about the same thickness it was and then gradually get down to just a little bit about the width of a piece of paper. And when we get to the tail fin now, just like we had done with the pear shader, we're going to start right here and we're going to pull it out to the edge. This way. And from here all the way around to this other side, is where we're going to have it real thin along this edge. And the reason why we're thinning this down real thin, as you can see here, is here in a little bit we're going to fold this tail fin over and we're going to glue it together, and this way it'll look like one thickness of leather. Now I'm going to skive the uh, dorsal fins, and I'm just doing it on the back side of the part where we did the lined pear shader, the top of the dorsal, from the back side. As you can see, getting it real thin at the top. And now we're going to be, we're going to skive the smooth side at the base of the fin. And this does not have to be as thin as before, really all we want to do is take off the top grain of the leather because we'll be applying glue to this piece just so it'll adhere, the glue it'll adhere better. And we're going to do this on the next piece also. Now that I'm finished with the safety beveler, I'm going to take this skiving knife and stick it right into the edge here where I could not get with the safety beveler and thin the edge down. Nice tool to be able to get into the nice tight areas. And that's sharp so you want to go slow And just get that corner right in there. Like so. And that's all there is to the skiving.